Hello, my Leo cross watchers. How are you doing? Come on in. If you are here, you're here to find out what a Leo is up to doing, thinking, saying, and feeling. Guys, let's get into it. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. If this is not the energy of your Leo, then you know what? We'll catch you on the next one or check out their moon and rising and uh, Venus. If you happen to know, you can get a broader picture. Um, yeah, this may resonate just a little bit, may not. You'll know. You'll get triggered. You'll turn red. You'll turn shaky. <laughs> Love I got. I got it by you. What is in Leo's energy? Let's go. Please like and subscribe. It makes me smile. Please watch my Monday morning fills as I give a lot of updates. I'm going to start giving away cash prizes over there. Led by God. Guided by you, Spirit. Let's go. Last one out. Thank you. What is up? And Leo's energy. Last one out. up in Leo's energy on the board spirit on the board they're taking their time hmm Leo's a pretty fast acting so depends on what they have in their chart too being patient okay they're being patient to make a decision oh they may want to marry somebody they've taken their time to make a decision on you know am I is this person marriage material is this person who I want to marry is this person who I want to get engaged to. Be patient and noble. Take a decision. Engagement and wedding. And we saw take time first. So let's get into tarot here. For Leo. What is in Leo's energy? A tower? Oh God. A strength in reverse. Let's go. Led by God. Guided by you. Let's go. For Leo, what's in their energy? Let's go. Sir. What can we tell the cross watchers of the Leo world? Led by God, guided by you. I did see strength in reverse when I said that there's Leo themselves, you know? And maybe they're just really nervous, I feel. Last one out, last one out. energy what's up let's go on the board tower i said it on the split is it tower moment what is this tower damn that's squirt right there and sad i believe Sorry, guys. He's got Virgo and Gemini. I hit the board with the, uh, and Virgo again with the, um, Magician, Three of Swords, and Three of Pentacles. Hold on here. What's the Three of Swords about? I mean, I can see there's a tower moment there manifesting in a Queen of Pentacles, but what's this Three of Swords about? Oh, an ending. A transformation. How is this going? They are manifesting that this will not end. Maybe they feel marriage and engagement would stop. This Queen of Pentacles, they might be wanting to leave. And maybe it's just that Leo's already taken their time since they came out with the tower and the split. They were strength in reverse and tower. It's the first sight. Tower upright. Guys, they just, they're manifesting that this person's to stay because... But there's a transformation. There's work that needs to be done before 
I don't know. We're going to be for what. We're going to go find out. But right now, they're in broken heart over a Queen of Pentacles. What's this death card in reverse? Squirts on the board again, guys. Gemini. Leo, strength. Okay. There's a lot of major arcanas in here, guys. There's, a, there's fire right here. Leo may have been in and out, and now they're going to have to have strength to uh, pull this together and do the work and the transformation. I think they were in and out in their energies, yeah, and now they want to fast act about something and take that leap towards making that transformation and starting something new with somebody that they're brokenhearted about. And they don't want to leave. And that's why they may, they're being called to be patient with this, you know, engagement and marriage or whatever it is. It could be just a bigger contract at work, whatever. And uh, what happened here? Five of Wands, drama. Yeah, they were in and out. They were causing some drama. I feel whoever it is they were with or working or friends with just said, I can't do this anymore. And it really has broken this person's heart, this Leo's heart. They're getting the strength to do the work to transform this because they know that they were in and out of this. And they don't want, they didn't want to be. And I'm going to be honest, I think the one that's been patient and know is the person that's been waiting for Leo to calm down and join them in whatever it is at the same level that they are bringing. This other person may have brought a uh, ten of swords or they felt like Leo brought ten of swords. Like Leo wants to reverse that. But there's a, there's been a little, there's already been an ending here. And they're wanting it back. They want it to come back. But I have a feeling somebody moved away from them and took their energy right with them. Another major cancer chariot, ten of swords in reverse. That drama, okay? I feel they put ten of swords in someone else's back and now they're having to reverse that. And they want to try to become your king of pentacles. What are they moving forward to? What is, what is Cherry Air for? Cancer? Separation. just came out Capricorn. This is a crazy story. Read whatever. So Leo has had a tower moment. I believe somebody has walked away, put them in separation. They're trying to move past it. They're trying to move past the toxicity, the jealousy, the insecurities because they do want to bring a transformation to this. Okay, guys, there was a lot of drama leading up to this and I feel it's broke both hearts. They're manifesting it back in, the Queen of Pentacles back in. They want to do the transformation work. They want to have the strength to do the work and not be so in and out with their energy, whatever it was that they were energetically being out in and out with either physically or just energy, emotions, whatever. Um, I don't think they want to move towards a separation. I think they want to move out of a separation. But they're having to uh, realize their toxicities. In the meantime, the devil, their insecurities, whatever it is, through this separation, there will be fast action and communication of what? And then we're going to... 
an oracle to see of the Queen of Wands. That they're transforming, that they're getting out of the toxic way, becoming passionate and creative and confident and not insecure and not codependent and okay they're going to come communicate this to you they want to start this over and take that leap and it may be that they just want to come right in and be like look i love you and i've effed up and i want to come in and i want to marry you and this and that but they're having to be patient because of the work that they have to do let's go for Leo's Crest Watchers. What is going on here for Leo's Crest Watchers? Let's go let that God guided by you. They might have to find some help with that, with, with, with them, the community, friends, maybe a therapist. They need to talk about some things, I feel it. I feel like they don't even know that they did wrong. Like, what they felt they were doing wasn't a big deal or something. But that tower sure is telling them it is. <laughs> and they better do some work with that death card in reverse. Just imagine, yeah, they're imagining. What are they imagining? Chop wood. Yeah, they need to get on it. They need to do a lot of work on themselves. Buy the book. New life. And mending. So they need to get on it. They're imagining what they could do to change things. How much further this can go. They want to mend it with you. They want to, you know, fix it. They really do. But I don't know, we're going to find in the next one, I don't feel whomever the Queen of Pentacles is wants to or will allow them. We're going to find out on the next one. Until then, guys, please like, subscribe, um, check out the Moon, Rising, Venus. You'll get a much broader picture. Check out your own. If this is not their energy, then this is not your story. Otherwise, you be blessed, you be well, and bye for now, guys.